Hey there, I'm out here wiring up an NB2 uh, coil on plug ignition system into my VVT swapped NB1. Um, there's pretty good information on this um, on the forums as far as pinouts go. Probably 90% of this I found on the forums. Um, I'm taking it a little bit further so that it's incredibly easy. You don't have to do any cutting or splicing into the factory harness um, and a huge part of that is these connectors here uh, these are from ballinger motorsports i'll leave all the information in the description for everything as well as putting the part numbers up on screen um, everything i found on the forums used these plugs here these go into the actual coils but i didn't see anybody using these um, these go into your factory harness so that you don't have to do any cutting or splicing as far as factory wiring. Um, one important thing to note, you'll see I have everything already labeled. I'll put the pinouts in the description and on screen. Um, I marked this one with a dot because if you look over here, um, those are your two plugs that feed your coils. Um, one of them you see there has a blue collar with a white dot on it. That one feeds cylinders one and four, and the other one obviously feeds two and three. I uh, definitely don't want to get those mixed up. If yours, for whatever reason, is missing that blue collar, uh, the wire colors are different. So just pay attention to the pinout, and you'll be able to figure it out either way. So I'll get started. Uh, I'm going to start off with mounting the actual coils so I can figure out the wire length and then we'll go from there. All right, you can see I've got the coils mounted there now. I uh, just wanted to make a note, the bolts you need are M6 by one by 16 mil. All right, so as you can see, I've got everything kind of mocked up in here. Yeah, obviously gonna tidy all this up and wrap it up uh, once I verify that it'll fire. Um, something I didn't mention before, uh, if it's not obvious, these connectors here are not completely necessary. If you want to save yourself some money, um, you can always splice into the factory harness or just cut uh, those factory plugs off and solder right to the wire. Uh, to me, 20 bucks was worth not having to do that, but completely up to you. Um, so we'll go ahead and see if it fires. All right. As you can see, we're all wrapped up and good to go. Uh, I just use this fabric wiring harness tape and get pretty much anywhere. Um, wrapping these coil wires is completely unnecessary. I just did it for aesthetic reasons. You can see we're all plugged up back there. And uh, yeah. If you have any questions, just drop them in the comments. I'll try to get back to you. Making YouTube videos isn't really my thing, so I'm sure there's stuff I missed. I just kind of wanted to get this info out there because it took me a little bit of digging to find, and if I can make it easier for somebody, that's cool. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.